welcome to the Crazy Vape Show number 14. Um, I'm going to get my screen up. So you've got myself, Eat My Baby, and you've got Dummy Crazy Damper. Me! Going on with the What are you using, Dummy? At the moment, I'm vaping the Hive on the uh, Hammer of God. In, seri I'm in not series, in series, <laughs> <laughs> mm, really nice. <coughs> oh my! And on the on the other hand, the OBS Mini, from big to small. Uh, I'm gonna turn my sound off somewhere. That's better. Okay, <laughs> I hear myself talking. <laughs> The OBS Mini, and I'm still vaping <coughs> the Bulk, the Bulk RTA, and of course the Armadillo on the Squonker. And in everything, I've got coffee in all the big ones, and in the small one, there's my at the moment. Uh, my tobacco <laughs> with some CBD and oh yeah and I'm also using my Audion and then I'm testing in at the moment is it Hakuna or Tropical? I think Tropical from uh, 12 Monkeys and that's everything Are you that's sure? Good. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure <laughs> uh, I'm using the Flash VT1 by Umer with the free max firelight 2 on top it has got cherry mint on it I'm also using the Umair rudder with the cool vapor the calvary, Cal RT calvary RDT yeah vapor. and I've got my VK530 with the horiz horizon um, I'm going to get this wrong, I can I am Falcon? Falcon King? Falcon, Falcon King, yeah yeah, Falcon King. <laughs> um, <laughs> I've also brought the Relxit pod kit. Yeah. So testing that at the moment as well. And that's about it. I, I just reviewed it this week. <laughs> oh, have I got batteries that? Yeah. And I'll probably be using that as well. Yeah. Which is the top side, and I can't remember the name of the dripper. <laughs> <laughs> That's how bad it is today. Yeah. Okay. Who's in chat already? In yours? Hi, John. As Glad always, hi, John. Yeah. In mine, Luke, Jenny, Patcher, and Stephen. Goedenavond, Adrian. And if you are in chat, just put a wee comment in so we can you hear, and you will get a shout out. Yep. Oh, yo Bjorn, my chat. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how many is watching now. <laughs> and if you have any questions, just shoot, because I don't know what to talk about this evening, so <laughs> shoot. <laughs> yeah, if you are watching, put a wee comment in the chat so Ken, you're there. If you want to ask us any questions, ask away. That will help the show go quicker. <laughs> <laughs> I've actually coiled up my hive, but I don't think I've put enough cotton in it. Yeah, you have to put a lot of cotton in it, because that's why it's starting to leak. If you put, if you fill it more than 10 milliliters in it, and you don't wick it um, thick enough, it's starting to leak. The first time, yeah, <laughs> it ran dry on me. <laughs> so, well, yeah. Mine just sat in, in my wee tub. For my week test, yeah. there was nothing there. But when I vape it, it just passes out the air holes. <laughs> so it's like uh, I take it I've not got enough cotton. Either that, it's producing too much condensation. <laughs> mm, uh, I like it. <laughs> I really, I'm, I'm vaping it all week now. <laughs> well, I still don't have a mod for it. The biggest mod I've got is. Uh, I joy Captain 
PD two seventy. And I've still got overhang. Yeah. Um, the only thing that I've side, got that side and that side. <laughs> the only thing I've got is a hammer I've got for it, so I've got a series built in it. Uh from uh my new sponsor for my channel. He sent me some series uh Clapton uh some series Claptons I think. Yeah. Series Fields Claptons, yeah. And are really nice coils. And yeah. Clean it once already because with the coffee Mm, two days, three tanks, and mm, <laughs> I really need to change a cotton. <laughs> it, <laughs> it's good. It, it doesn't smell good anymore. Then it's burnt caramel. <laughs> if you're looking for a dual RTA, yes, get the ZX. That's good. Hi, Gareth. Davy. Gareth. Connie, hi. hi. Uh, I'm planning on getting one. The Zeus X, yeah, it's not a bad one. If you do want so something better than the Zeus X, that single coil would be the gear of the kelp uh, um, or the saw three. Mm. The um, John is asking: Is it worth getting the flash mod or the and the rudder? Yep, yeah, it's worth it. I think for me, it's worth it. <laughs> I think the flash mod really fires fast. I also got it here besides me. By the way, another one I'm vaping. <laughs> Couldn't I tell you about the rudder yet. I've just started using that from last night, so I've started to test it. But so far, so good. Yeah. And the flash, it does take a wee bit getting used to, because I keep pushing the top button as a fire button. <laughs> the fire button. <laughs> okay, but that's just but you. I'm getting used to it. Yeah, I'm getting used to it. <laughs> yeah, but it fires fast. I think the new version now it really fires really fast with the new chip in it. Because the the, uh, the first one I've got wasn't that fire didn't fire that fast so. The new ones, I uh, really like it. It's, 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 nah. I, I don't Hi, know. <laughs> Vaping Smurf. <laughs> I. <laughs> if you're new to the show, this show is broadcasted over two YouTube channels, so there are two YouTube chats going at the same time. <laughs> Just in case you wonder why you were saying. Hiya to people and they're not showing up in chat, they're another chat. But it's best to go along and open up both chats and just watch on either or YouTube channel. What Mark saying? <laughs> and pop in some questions please. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see if I can get this to work. What's not working? No, everything's working. Yeah, I see my life going too, so that's a something. <laughs> I just need the link so I can copy it from mine to yours. Oh yeah, I, I stay off all the computer work now. <laughs> if I touch <laughs> something... Both yep. channels and both charts. Yep, Mike's doing all the computer work. <laughs> <laughs> I keep my hands on mine. Can't. Yeah, I keep my hands on mine. <laughs> if he's working, just keep the hands off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Some good nick salts. Um. Davy is asking for some good nick salts for in his um, cobble. Hmm. It's difficult to say for me because I'm almost always vaping the same one, <laughs> my <laughs> honey roasted tobacco, and now I'm testing the twelve monkeys. And mm, yeah, they're not bad, but 
I'm still in my pot systems and everything. I, I need my tobacco with my CBD and I don't need anything else. <laughs> so it's <laughs> difficult to say what are good ones and bad ones for me. So, but uh, there are some new ones now. As, and they're, they're coming in Belgium, they're coming a lot of new ones in the next few weeks. So it's. it's wait for a few weeks and then they're go gonna be some good <laughs> different nick salts because for the moment in belgium it's it's really uh, really small amount of difference uh, actually so it's all going through tpd now <laughs> Demi, you did show everything that you uh, got at expo last week didn't you what what did i you did show everything that you got at Expo in last week's show. Yeah. Right, John. So you have to go back to last week's show and watch it. He's asking <laughs> what you all got. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> but I've brought everything out that I got already. I'm currently testing one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> No, I'm I'm gonna start testing this week with a lot of things from the expo, the passage and the FP and the, yeah and yeah, one of the tanks from Asmodus. Those I'm gonna start testing tomorrow. So tomorrow it's a whole big switch of <laughs> things I'm going to use. <laughs> <laughs> I may have five out in testing five, but I'm concentrating on just two because that's all I can review at any week. Apart from last night, I got three because one was uh, um, hexapod. Because uh, that's a five minute job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've got a new way of reviewing now, so I did five reviews this week. So I can now I do it, I do my reviews like I do my lives. Just with the computer, and I do it all live. I do my, my FaceTime, I go to the close up live, just with some uh, commercial between it. and. It records faster and it's fun to do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to edit everything. It just goes on and on. And if I make a mistake, it's like that. And <laughs> well, and seeing that last night, I changed how I did my review. Because usually I do the going straight down and then I'll stop it and start the other camera for doing the bulb and then stop it and start the camera going yeah. down again. Where last night I just kept both of them running for the full time. Yeah. I was doing the close up bold section. <laughs> so I was like, move the camera in just before I start using that camera and take it out when I'm finished. <laughs> yeah, I try to do it with no editing now. Just go full alive and just <laughs> see where it goes. <laughs> and it records faster and it's just fun to do. It, it, it takes what? 30 40 minutes and everything is ready the the it, it's i don't have to edit anything i just can upload it <laughs> like it is <laughs> <laughs> it's easy oh, no. yeah so. i still have to edit mine yeah uh -huh. i don't it, it it went well the last five reviews and in my in my in all my videos people said oh, it's a, it's nice like that so it's easy I just go on now <laughs> yeah if I had to do that I'd have to use both the webcams because my camcorder can't get plugged into the computer oh to record yeah. it so I have to put it to memory card which means I've got the audio on one file I've got the footage from one camera the footage from the other camera and I have to tie the full three in so they're all in sync with each other. Okay. No, I can I can hang the, the, the Canon camera on the computer and it goes through a, a program from Canon where it's and then there it's a webcam and you c and you can uh, use it as a a remote control for the camera and that screen I get into XSplit and use as my close up. So the, the the quality of the, the 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 picture goes down a little bit but it's easy to use and I can use it in the lives <laughs> and I or, and now I ordered uh, a, a battery 
to plug my camera in so I don't uh, don't have to care about the battery life so <laughs> it's just I let it run and it's easy it works it works really easy <laughs> I never thought about that setting the camera up as a webcam yeah that's that's how how it works it's a webcam and that's you take that screen and you pop that into XSplit or OBS and then you can use it as your uh, in one scene it's it's the close up and that's easy to use and so I can do everything live I go from uh, my FaceTime to my close up live just with my commercial from my new sponsor between it now and I can <laughs> <laughs> and I can set up in one piece and that's easy and just talk on and, and if something goes wrong yeah something goes wrong <laughs> 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 makes it yeah <laughs> it, it makes it fun to do again <laughs> I was tired of all the <laughs> editing actually and I loved I still love my live shows and I was tired of all the editing of the reviews so now I, now I do my reviews like I'm doing a live show and <laughs> that makes it fun yeah. again I'm not too bad because I finish with my camera over this side. I've also got the mic over this side, so I do the start of my video, and then I move the camera and the mic over to the back of me, <laughs> do the close up, uh. and then move it back across. So I'm finishing over here, <laughs> okay, <laughs> for the end. Now, and then it's all here for me for the live show. With me, everything is. Here's my camera for my close-up. <laughs> so it's just, I just t have to turn to my left and I can do the close-up and I can turn back and I can do my FaceTime again. Everything is really close together. Nice. <laughs> so mm. I like the setup like it is now. I don't have to move anything, just wave my chair and I can do the other work. <laughs> Easy. Uh, looking I at the chat. If I clean the junk off this desk, I could probably get away with doing the close-ups on this desk. But then my mic would be in the rod. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because my arm's in front of me. Which means it would be in front of me, sort of where the camera is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with me the, it's here, and if I do the close-ups, I do my mic to this way. <coughs> Just turn a bit. Oh, that's too much in front of me. <laughs> Gonna read the chat for a second, because otherwise... Yeah, it should just go main, doesn't it? Hmm. Uh, they're asking when the pro probeer calls will be available in Zonova. I'm not sure, Koneke. Um The probeer calls aren't um, available in Belgium yet. <laughs> so... There, you, you, you can order them online at the moment, and we're going to try to find a, a wholesale for it. And I'm looking for a tank. What would you recommend for me? I love to use it up to 70 watts. Um, Harley Quinn is asking what tank you would recommend, and uh, she would she's vaping until 70 watts. Depends if you want single coil, dual coil. Uh, and how much just capacity? <coughs> okay, Harley, did you hear it? <laughs> you want single coil, dual coil, or um, factory coil? <laughs> Hi, Giovanni. <laughs> Waiting for the answer. <laughs> I'm gonna vape on my hybrid. Dual. Yep. The hive. <laughs> 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 nah, that's me and 70 watts for that. Nah. Just with the air that's going through it. <laughs> no. Right, you've got. It's 0 0.3 in series. Hmm, no. It's not 70 watts. Dual coil. For the moment, I like the. the for me, the bulk, I like the bulk. <laughs> I've not got that, so I can't tell about mm -hmm. that. Got a Zeus X. Um, so that's got oil. So that. 
You've got the Solemn Three. I think it's Joe's that single. What? Solemn Three. That's Joe's. Solomon that Solomon Three. I don't still don't have it. It's still on its way, but I think it's a single. Isn't it Is single? single? I, no, isn't it? I don't know. I'm going to check. <laughs> Hi, Jay Jerry. It's still, it's still, it's still on his way. Hey, Jay Jerry. <laughs> the hive's still okay. big. Yeah, I know the hive's still big. No, no, it is. It's single or dual. It's single or dual. That's, okay. That's the one with the two different Air Force cuts. Okay. Um, uh, they were. They're gonna send me it, but they they got some new things on the way, and they're gonna send it all together. <coughs> so. <laughs> The FP forgot the rest. The FP. I still have. Jerry, I still have the FP to test, so I can't say how good it is. Still have to test it. And I've never had one, so I can tell you. I can only go by what I've used. <laughs> <laughs> oh, screen is falling away. Uh, Vapefly Core RTA, I like also. The, I can't say that. I don't have the Vapefly. Uh, mm. What's another one I like for a dual coil? <coughs> uh, if the, you want to go yeah, back mm, about a year. Yeah, the Juggernaut, I still like the Juggernaut. You do have. The Iron Maiden. <laughs> I put it like that. What's that? Iron Maiden. I can't. I, I don't. I, I don't know him. It's made by <coughs> Helvet. Yeah, the Helvet. It is old. <laughs> it's a RDTA, and it comes with. Yeah, oh, coils aren't that bad. <laughs> What's that? But with the ceramic cap, you don't get any split back on a hung set. Okay. And it also blocks your full holes. Um, which is pretty good, so it doesn't leak. <coughs> oh man, I'm dying. <laughs> uh. Well, a little them boom boom boom. Looking forward to see your thoughts on the FP. Yeah, I think I'm gonna start um, testing him tomorrow. I'm gonna build him tomorrow. I think. Gonna take it to work and start building it tomorrow. Uh, Crete RTA. Crete. Hmm. Don't have it either. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm still thinking of some good ones. Huh. That's a bit the only good ones I've so I've got so many behind me. <laughs> <laughs> That's because you're a hoarder. Uh, I know. No, no, I I'm, a, I'm a collector. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds better. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to have to start packing up some kit that's lying about <laughs> on my desks. Because I'm running out of space in front of me. And hip is queer. <laughs> and I'm running out of space at the back of me. Mm, you don't want to look around here. I have to clean up my my cave till next when t till Wednesday because Wednesday they're gonna measure up everything in the house because they're gonna start building a new um, apartment building next to the house uh, next to our house and they, they have to measure everything up to see if everything change if ev anything changes when they're building it so <laughs> from my wife said you have to clean up your man cave so got a lot of work to do <laughs> really <laughs> so I don't even know where, where I have to start <laughs> so, so. Uh, I came with all the boxes and they're all sitting now 
<laughs> no, you don't want to look around here really. At the moment, there's boxes everywhere, there's cables everywhere, there's mess on the ground everywhere, there's empty cans, empty bottles, empty glasses. <laughs> uh, you don't want to look around here. <laughs> so, and it's really, it's everywhere. <laughs> Yeah, so. I'm sort of the same for the table to the wall. <laughs> yeah, but here is even the floor, everything is full. <laughs> it's in, uh, <laughs> at the moment, uh, it's not that. And how many mods there are on my desk at the moment? And if I do my close up, it's always like put my hands on it, make my build mat free, <laughs> and then <laughs> I can do my close up. <laughs> it's really. It, it, no, it's. It's, it's well, I'm like, I have to clear my ball mat and then clear three spots for the legs for the tripod. <laughs> <clears throat> mm. Luckily, my lights are all set up and they they keep where they. I don't have to move there anything for uh, for mm. it. So there's only one light I have to move, and that's the one that's over there. Because I move it from straight in front of me to the side. So uh -huh. one either side of me. Yeah. Well, Here you see where my light it's in front of me. You see it in in the glass yeah. behind me. So yeah. and you see my screen in the glass behind me. <laughs> <laughs> well if I move this way, I've got this light here. It yeah. shines down. And I've also got the ring light here. The ring light That's is my good. Light. Yeah, yeah. I want a ring light. <laughs> Um, I think I paid about 15 quid off Amazon for it. Hmm. Yeah, I'm a, yeah. I just now ordered the, the battery for my camera. Now, next month there's something else. and <laughs> I need my new computer, <laughs> so uh, let's to see what I'm going to do. <laughs> um, next thing I'll buy will probably be a lens for my Canon camera. Uh, I hope oh, next month the computer. Uh, 155. Zoom on it at least. Mm, uh, I don't know anything about lenses, so I'm keeping with mine. <laughs> so the, the next thing is a computer, really, really. The next thing, when I, when I've got the money, there's a computer, <laughs> and, I, and two <laughs> screens in front of me that I don't have to use the laptop anymore. Would be nice. <laughs> um, the bulk creed and this set should all be ready to actually get from shops at the moment, if I remember right. Not in Belgium yet. The bulk isn't ready in Belgium yet. Yeah. But you can in some some places you can get it. And the Crete you can all that's already passed. And the Zeus X you can order now in Belgium. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Patrick, a clan of Alakistal. <laughs> a pig cave. Yeah. <laughs> That's how a man cave has to be. <laughs> Hi, Xor. Xor is my chat. That's him. Hi. <laughs> I need to try and get a hold of the book myself. Yeah, the book is really... I, I like it. It's But I close the, the airflow halfway down. Because when it's open, it's too much. I even cool my airflows down. Always. Because I use the whole wattage. Mm, I, I use it on a 100 watts. So. See, I'd be at about 35, 40 watts with it. <laughs> with the bulk. That, the bulk is too big for that. The airflow is too wide for that. Really. It's not a, a low wattage tank. What's the same size as it? What? What tank is the same size that I've got? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, but the Kelpie is that about the same size? Nah, this is twenty-eight. Ah, oh, it's not that big then. Um, but it's not that. It's a really wide airflow and. The drip tip, it's a really wide drip tip, really wide one. Okay, nothing compared to the hive, but this is a really wide one. 
30 mil. É. Yeah. I'm made. 35 watts. Airflow closed right down. <laughs> but uh, nah. Nah, well. nah, for <laughs> for that low wattage, come on. <laughs> the, uh, I'm only uh, about three, no, point three, point four joule coil. That's about as low as I go. Like, um, Cheap, yeah. stop coil, point two ohms, thirty watts. Thirty watts with, what? Ah, and, and that's down, but the the the, what tank is that? Firewood 2 with a 0.2 ohm coil in it. Come on! Out. And what's the recommended wattage from the coil? And there's my airflow. Yeah, and what's the recommended wattage? What's the recommended wattage on the um, coil? It doesn't have it on it. Doesn't <laughs> have it on it? Come on! No. No? Oh, come on. Because no. the firewood coils has got the squares cut into the coil. Yeah. Well, you can see it there. That's like squares all the way around. Hmm. Well, I don't have. Well, uh, no, I don't have you know one. You the No, I've got it in the shop, but I don't have it myself now. Well, have a look at the coils, and it's uh, yeah, it's a dual coil. A dual coil and then on 35 watts. No, okay. 30 watts. 30 watts, come on. <laughs> yeah. uh, wait, oh. So, can you compare the triple RTA in dual coil mode with the bulk RTA? Uh, yeah, you can, yeah. But then the bulk is better, I think. Gives a little bit more flavor than uh, the triple RTA, but the airflow is, is quite yeah. The airflow is li similar. Uh, see you, peeps. I'm off the meet. Bye, Davy. Bye, David. Yeah, I'm also 0 0.12 on dual dual coil. I don't know, 35 watts on. On some pitch tank, right? <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> For me, it's always around 100 watts with my dual coils, or else <laughs> on my mount to lungs around 25, <laughs> but never <laughs> direct to lungs so, so low. If I, I if I vague direct along, it really has to be <laughs> coming in like a bitch. <laughs> but that's the thing. I don't vape direct one. I'm restricted one. That's why my airflow's turned down and the wattage is turned down. My on the hive too. My airflow is almost almost closed for <laughs> so. But that's on the hive. But. Uh, Actually, yeah. yeah, I'm starting to close. <laughs> I'm starting to close down my airflow more and more lately. So, but in the beginning, I was always vaping with the airflow wide open. But I'm more for the flavor now, so I need more restriction. But still, on 100 watts, <laughs> it still has to kick me in the ass. <laughs> yeah. That's why yeah. I like this one. This is a 0 0.3 coil <laughs> on the in series. That's nice. That's what? 170 watts or so? Um, yeah, that's why my batteries probably last me two years because I don't hammer them at high wattage. Yeah. Okay, my, my batteries <laughs> all, already. My, all my batteries are almost two years old. But okay, they don't last me that long anymore. But <laughs> I really need to change I all my batteries. I've got a full day out of my batteries. Mm. I'm, uh, I really need some new ones because <laughs> all my batteries now, mm, if they if they run two hours, it's 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 been good. Hi, <laughs> <I> Graham. <laughs> Hi, Graham. <laughs> yeah, 
I saw it on the expo, everybody wanted the bulk. <laughs> <laughs> so did I, and I couldn't get one. Me neither on expo. <laughs> They sent it me to eat when I get home, but... <laughs> yeah, never saw it meat, though. <laughs> uh, I've got one in giveaway. <laughs> you, <to> me. <coughs> you can win one in my giveaway. No, <laughs> I can't understand your giveaways. Don't have to do anything. Just put a comment, <laughs> just put a comment under the video and that's it. <laughs> yeah. my, my giveaways are easy now. Ah, so mine's are just day night, but <laughs> <laughs> I've got two giveaways running. <laughs> Even one for the relics, for the pot system. <laughs> so, yeah, John, I can take batteries from the shop, but I've got. I take so much from the shop so I can't take batteries are pretty expensive so I don't take no batteries all the time from the shop and I want uh, I'm not gonna say where I'm gonna try to buy them <laughs> 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 but uh, I, if I need no batteries I, I buy them in wholesale price so it's it's, it's okay <laughs> yeah we've got two good shops over here websites anyway uh, just to make sure you're getting authentic <laughs> <laughs> yeah there's ha, if you if you have to buy batteries in the shop it's pretty expensive in Belgium so a lot of people order mm -hmm. them online I think I was about 650 a battery in, in shop it's uh, 12.95 euro for one for one battery like make model huh? make a model a Sony VTC 6 or doesn't matter every battery no. is around that price including the 30 Q's the 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 yeah oh. <laughs> so but we only sell in our shop we only sell the Sony's for the moment but I'm thinking of changing the batteries I'm not sure depends on uh the wholesales in Belgium. <laughs> What's coming in? Good night, Harley. <coughs> uh, what's new? What's new? What's new? <laughs> I'm thinking, oh, I'm, and I just uh, posted this, yeah, I want to know, I don't know how many there are still in chat, but I want to know people's uh, meaning about products like the Vibe and the Logic from the tobacco companies, what people think of that, and if they think it's a good thing for vaping or it's a bad thing for vaping that tobacco companies get uh, on the on the on the back on the vape uh, get on vaping too and try to push their products between it I want to know what people think of it because I just um, posted a comparison between the both of them and I and I told my meaning about it in my video and I already got some comments on it so <laughs> I want to know people in chat what they think about the tobacco companies um, getting into vaping now. That's a question from me to the chat. Uh, there's 22 in chat when I checked. Okay, so... Between the two. <coughs> uh, yeah, if you've got any questions, put it in chat and try and answer them. Try. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> me too. Hmm? It doesn't matter what chart you use, we'll get to it <laughs> eventually. I'm still a surprise, my, 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 uh, my life is still going on with no problems. <laughs> Kind of hold some woods. <laughs> but Touch wood, nothing's went wrong this <laughs> evening yet. <laughs> still got a long way to go though. Oh, my head is full of other things at the moment. I'm, I'm st um, my head is full of thinking of new designs to, to 
come up and I've got some things to come up with <laughs> and get it on paper and my head is almost exploding at the moment what's been said in your chat uh, what's been said in my chat um hip and park drafting um Giovanni paid uh, 1595 euro for a, a battery <laughs> and he had needed three so now he's also uh, buying them online because it's cheaper <laughs> that does seem a lot for one bar eh? yeah that's a lot but that's in shop it really is expensive because if you see wholesale prices for shops are almost the same price as you pay no they're even more than you pay it online so for the wholesale price for a shop if you if you count in on the per percentage for the shop it, it's really batteries are really expensive in the shop shop this is a problem from for the wholesale prices so i i can't understand how some online shops can sell their batteries on that price <laughs> if an, if a shop in belgium his wholesale price is sometimes a lot more <laughs> than the price online so it's, it's yeah it's strange so it's 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 difficult for shops to uh, to sell uh, to 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 get customers understand why batteries are so expensive in the shop not too expensive in shops mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't say too expensive in a shop. I'm working in a shop. <coughs> <laughs> but they're still too expensive. Yeah, but I can't help that and I'm I still want to sell some batteries. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't say they're too expensive. <laughs> so yeah. I rewrap them for free. If your batteries wraps are uh broke, I I rewrap the batteries for free. <laughs> so that's something. That's a service you get with the batteries. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you have to buy them in a shop <laughs> and support your local dealer. <laughs> uh, I don't mind them. It's the way to get off smoking. Do I go and test? Yeah, it's an answer about your pods. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Happened to a vaping or might be in a shop wants to sell free up but I never will purchase something from them. Um yeah. Th that's I'm not sure m my opinion is still I'm not sure if it's a good thing or a bad thing that the tobacco companies it's it's a good thing it takes money into the vaping and they can persuade governments to support vaping like the UK government does but I'm also afraid they're gonna push out all the things like RDAs and RTAs and they're gonna only try to push through all the, the small pot systems they're gonna they're gonna bring on the market so from uh, I'm not sure what to think of it is it a good thing or a bad thing I'm not sure what to think of it I think it'll be a good thing because I'll get more smokers off the cigarettes that's and hopefully eventually they will move on to bigger things like these kits yeah uh, but I, yeah it's, I, I, at the moment I don't see it in my shop I see people starting to vape with pot systems but there's a, a few only a few people go over to bigger if so and a lot of people from big the who vaped with bigger devices going to pot systems now and it's all pot 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 everywhere <laughs> at the moment and and I, and I and I think it's because of all we can't make in we don't uh, the vape industry can't make any commercials or anything but it's strange like the Vipen, the Logic and all those things you see commercials from it and they don't get the, the, the fees or they get the fees and they just pay it because there's a lot more money behind it 
and it's the same with the TPD all the products need to go to a six months TPD uh, reg registration in Belgium but like the vape and the logic they're not here six months in Belgium but they're already true to the TPD and everything and everything is all right for it because the money behind it I'm a little bit scared of it too there's uh, too much money behind the tobacco industry and they can push the vape industry out of the way and as John says it'll just be closed pod systems that they'll use so you have to keep going and buying the pods yeah. so eventually people will find out the price of the pods and then they'll find out the price of a decent setup that takes stock coils which is cheaper and lasts longer yeah and that's how they'll change that's so what I get hope people off the pods and onto other cats but I'm uh, scared that the big tobacco companies are gonna persuade the governments to ban all the big devices and ban all the 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 RTAs and and everything because it would be bad for your health and only the small pot system they produce are better and they have the money to pay off governments and that's the thing I'm afraid of <laughs> yeah maybe over in your country I can't see it happening over here no, no I see it happening in Belgium <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem in Belgium, I think. Vape mystery. Hi, Demi, Master of Belgium. <laughs> Hi, Vape mystery. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, Benny. Uh, Hi, Max. <laughs> and Giovanni says, my problem, Demi, is my local shop has no... Um, has no knowledge of uh, anything of vaping and he has to drive 35 kilometers to find a good shop. Yeah. Yeah, no, there, too bad. there are a lot of shops popping up everywhere with people who don't know anything about vaping. But no, my new, newest shop locally is Mod King and he can read some of it, which is good. Wait, uh. <laughs> mm. oh, I'm trying to follow the chat because they said I don't do it enough so <laughs> and you always say it too so <laughs> and thinking about two things to at the one at once is difficult now and reading in Dutch and reading in English and <laughs> my brain is uh, yeah too 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 much lobbyist in Belgium give our minister an, an envelope and it's and she does what she and she does what they, they ask her uh -huh, that's true oh what was that ah, there is exactly a message held for review for John ah, okay we are going to have to already making roads to the Hmm. I think that should be the fucked up America and not the <laughs> <laughs> yeah they fucked up <coughs> but yeah th that's um, what I'm afraid of too with the pot systems yeah. Sa the same in my shop if, if a 16 year old comes into the shop and he asks for a for a hexa pot system I don't give him it's too much nicotine uh, the first thing I asked, do you smoke cigarettes? No, no, I was vaping. No, 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 no hexa. Sorry, you have to start vaping with no nicotine. <laughs> you don't get it from me. If he goes to another shop and he buys it there, that's their problem. But in my shop, no 16-year-old can get an hexa or anything with high nicotine. It, uh, it makes me shiver. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to make the, the, the 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 young people addicted to nicotine if they didn't even start using uh, f uh, smoking cigarettes or something so <laughs> but Graham I agree with you with the pre-filled pods the, that, the, the, the only thing that goes to zero in pre-filled pods is the vibe <laughs> and all the rest in Belgium is 20 or 10 if you're lucky <laughs> so 
I think mm, too much and I, I, I always try to keep take people starting vaping if they come to the shop and they say oh my J smoke and I always try to start as low as possible with the nicotine but <laughs> in reality I myself I vape 20 and more <laughs> and I take it but I, I, I'm always trying to let people start as low as possible. <laughs> yeah, it depends too many cigarettes they smoke a day, depends how much nicotine they'll need. Yeah. To uh, them and how much they smoke. That's the first thing I ask. If somebody says yeah. he smokes two packs a day, okay, then <laughs> he gets a lot of nicotine. <laughs> yeah. Should actually be getting more than twenty milligram. <laughs> yep, twenty. Yeah. Well, what's there in chats? Mm. Uh, Mr. Uh, okay. Your chat. But since I should have pre filled pots, is they are making a fortune on the e juice. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> With the filled <laughs> pot systems. Yeah. I know. And now I know why they're pushing the hexa. <laughs> 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 yeah, because that's a closed pod system. I do. And it's selling a lot in Belgium. And I think in the UK too. Cause Empire Vapeco also did a really good review about the Hexa. <laughs> yeah, Hexa's okay, but I don't like the package them. <laughs> There's not one bit of English on it. No? <laughs> no. <laughs> not even on the instruction manual. <laughs> and the same with the default pods. There's not one bit of English on it. No? Where? Where is that? Gonna take mine. <laughs> this is for Belgium. No, no, only English, Dutch and French. All the languages are on there. And <laughs> not English on the ones in England? That's strange. No. Um, I don't know what language they are, but you'll be able to can. Oh, but that's uh, that's from Belgium. That's you've got a Belgium one. They've got. I got the, that at Expo. <laughs> yeah, I know, but that's a Belgian version with a uh, with a German, with uh, French, and with Dutch on it. That's the Belgium version. The English for you've got a hexa in with the English uh, warnings on it and everything. You can order it online in English. I haven't. <laughs> no, okay, you haven't, but that's one from the expo, and that's a Belgian one <laughs> with yeah. the three languages on it. So you're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I you, can you, understand you, that. You've got a special one in the UK. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, John. Yeah, John. The pods don't last long. That's right. No. If I vape a hexa, and if I use like a, when I went to Expo, and a, if I use it on a on the airport, yeah, it's one day and the pot is empty. <laughs> I use it, the night I, I had to stay in Amsterdam after the Expo. Mm, that night I vaped a whole pot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hi, Chuck Master. Chunk Master. Sorry. <laughs> You'll get it right one day, Dummy. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Well, an hour already. <laughs> yeah, I never to go. I want to start building something actually. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Come and bow my high for me then. <laughs> yeah. I want to start testing the passage. So start testing it. Mm -hmm. But then I have to start building now. <laughs> <laughs> and the FP. I want to s test that too. Those two need to go tomorrow. 
Something. Right, Graham, for me to mix up two mil of juice, you're talking about 35 pounds, and they're selling it for what four or five pound. Uh, uh. Yeah. <laughs> How much? Mm -mm. I don't know. You should. You will. Your account will be right. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, the show, please. Okay. Het gebeurt met de zool dat ook in de tabakken in. Ja, ja, Patrick, I know what happens with uh, the jewel in the in the United States. Are there any pr new products you are really looking forward to review? <coughs> no. <coughs> <laughs> I'm looking forward to the dual, the the recurve dual that's on the way, and I'm looking forward to the new Kais things. I don't know what it is yet, <coughs> but they said they got two new things, so I'm looking forward to that. And for the rest, the passage, I want to start testing it, and the FP, <laughs> I want to start testing it. <laughs> looking forward to that. And the other things, mm, nothing really. But look, really looking forward to the FP. Everybody says it's it's a good one, so I'm really looking forward to that one. And I'm gonna start testing it. So looking forward to that one. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to anything because I haven't got a make man yet. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <coughs> you tell me about somebody last week that I had contact. And you think I could remember? What? You were meant to send me a message last week. Yeah. You said about contacting somebody, and you said you would message me that. I can't remember if it was Smoan or not. Oh, my and brain I, is I, freezing. <laughs> <laughs> and I wasn't going back and watching the live show for last week to find it. Yeah. That's why you said you would message me. But okay. you never. Okay. I'm looking up again. Yeah. <laughs> it's busy days. Uh, As always. Yep. Yeah. And and I was up here a lot this week, so I need to be a little bit more to uh <laughs> with the wife again. <laughs> <laughs> Dimi wants to play with sucks my suck my mud's passage. Yeah, I want to play with his <laughs> passage. Futon <laughs> mm. Aqua Master V2 RTA. I have to still have to look that up. Bye Giovanni. There you go, it was contact for Rinko. For Rinko? Oh yeah. It's just I look You it just up. have to send my PM on Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> Boom. Just oh yeah 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 the Facebook page. Just yeah, right. Uh, yeah. Messenger, just send on. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll send you the message. Um, um, huh? Do I have <laughs> something to write it down? Wait a second. Yeah. Writing it down. Yeah, not bad. I'm writing it down. Damn it, here. There's one. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Ringo. See, at least somebody's got a good memory. So, it's in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's on my desk, it's in front of me, I'm gonna think of it one day. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll be asking you next week about it again then. <laughs> no, 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 it's, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> yeah, still I need to be up here some days, so, sometime, so. 
Uh, it was the contact of Rinko for Mark. Uh, he, Thierry even <laughs> said it. <laughs> yeah, Thierry, I know. It's. A, uh, I'm gonna send it. <laughs> That's where I got it from. Was your chat? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh. Yeah, um, not something else I'm looking forward to. I'm looking forward to everything that's lying here behind me that I still have to review. <laughs> I'm always looking forward to everything. And I'm looking forward to the fake mail I'm going to get tomorrow. I've got a tracking, but I don't know what it is, so <laughs> that's always that's always uh, a nice thing so if something what's comes it? what's it coming at Santa? yeah I, I don't know that's the problem it's it's a, um. it's a it's a yeah I don't know it's a Chinese wait so can if can I see it I've got one coming from Waronet Oil wait, wait. let's see that could be anybody <laughs> I'm gonna see what company it comes from. Maybe. What? What for no? What for no? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> from what for no? That could be anybody. Uh, that's why I don't know what's coming. <laughs> 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 so I don't know, but it's coming from Hong Kong, so. <laughs> so is mine. That's in Germany at the moment. Uh, I don't know where it, where it's at at the moment. Oh wait, it's coming from oh. The Mingo Business Center, Byongmong, what for new? I don't know where that is. Tracer in, uh, on its way. Oh, wait. Here. Yeah, it's in Germany too. <laughs> it's in Leipzig at the moment. <laughs> and somewhere? Huh? Where about is that? Leipzig. Oh. In Germany. My package, so. It will arrive tomorrow, before the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna see to oh my life again. That is still working. Yep, still working. Okay. Um, you use more e-liquid e with a squonker than a normal dripping. Yes, Thierry. You use a lot more liquid with a squonker than with a normal dripping. If I use my Battlestar squonker, mm, I think four or five bottles a day <laughs> from the squonker, so it, it really goes fast. If I go out for 10, 10, 15 minutes, the bottle is empty. So yeah, I, I use a lot more <laughs> juice with a squonker than, with, than just with dripping. Uh, or with an uh, with an RTA depends on the RDA RTA because with the bulk the bulk all also uses a lot of juice on high wattage. But you do know why you use more when you're squonking than what you do when you're dripping. Yeah, I use a lot more in my squonking than my dripping. Yes, but do you know why? Why? Because <laughs> I because I keep it really wet when I'm squonking, <laughs> really wet. No. The e liquid is more at hand than what is when it's in a bottle. Because if you're dripping, you have to do that and squeeze your bottle to get the juice in. Yeah. With a squonky, you just push the button so you'll use it more. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yep. That and, my, mm -hmm. and I keep my cotton really wet when I'm squonking, so I use a lot more juice when I'm squonking. A lot more. <laughs> and with the hive, yeah. This week I, I vaped a lot of juice <laughs> with the hive. <laughs> so 
Do, what did they do? But so looking forward to it. It's to, Thor 2 does look good, but I wouldn't pay the money that they're wanting for it. For, for what? Thor 2. Thor I don't know. I'm lo I'm not looking enough reviews lately. <laughs> really. Don't have the time. I'm trying to think how much they were selling at Expo. I think it was about two twenty, two thirty or something. Yeah. Or was it one twenty, one thirty? It was above a hundred pound anyway. Well above a hundred pound. And it's like nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> It was the same as uh, I wanted to, the the stacked, the big one from CC, from uh, the Cloud Chasers on their stand, but it was 150 pounds and uh, it's too much. <laughs> but it was also a 40 a 40 millimeter stacked. Oh, I really wanted that one. <laughs> but, uh, too expensive. <laughs> Sometimes you have to say, no, <laughs> can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Bibi, what juice are you vaping on? Bibi's always juice, vaping the same juice. <laughs> <laughs> what juice am I vaping then, Dummy? Huh? What yeah. juice am I vaping? Uh, uh, tell <laughs> I'm always forgetting. <laughs> Firework 2 has got cherry menthol. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> and the other <laughs> one. Come on. <laughs> oh the my. Calvary and the Falcon have both got Frozen Pond. Frozen Pond, that's the one. <laughs> yeah, I don't have to say a lot because in everything is my coffee now, so. <laughs> I've tried Dr. Breath and I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. I'm really addicted to my coffee now. I can't. It's the first thing I vape in the morning, last thing I vape before to sleep, and in the day, in the morning I I woke up, I wake up, I, and the first thing I do is go, ah, and then my coffee. <laughs> <laughs> so I need both. <laughs> I can't do it only my direct lung. I can't do it only my mountain lung. I need both. <laughs> Uh, and I vape a lot lately since Expo actually since Expo my vaping went up <laughs> a lot <laughs> I don't know why but yeah. and also I'm really into my reviews again I'm excited about everything so <laughs> I vape a lot <laughs> I'm excited in everything again it's, it's yeah. and that's also, I'm excited I, c I could put five reviews in a week. <laughs> so, <laughs> I catch up uh, on things because everything is starting to to be too full here. <laughs> I only do two reviews a week. Some weeks I only do one. Yeah, I, f I, I kept one for, for one day from the Vibe in the Logic. I recorded it before, but. Now it's, since I'm doing it with the live, it's go. I've tried to record two reviews a day, two reviews in one day now, and then post one the day uh, the day after, and then keep one for a little bit later. I'm gonna try to try to do it like that. But I've got some things I'm excited about, and I want to review and I want to <laughs> put out. So and, uh, and then it goes faster again. So <laughs> it's. I'm I'm no planner. For me, it it goes like it goes, and <laughs> when it when I finish a review and it's all finished, I want to get it online. It's it's that's just me. I can't get it on my computer and keep it finished and don't post it. And no, oh, no, I need to post that. <laughs> that's just me. I'm no planner. I am. Like I've reviewed the uh, hexapod. Yeah. <coughs> and it won't get posted until next Monday not tomorrow but the week after oh, I can't do that <laughs> <laughs> I'm always too excited when, when the review is finished I'm too excited to post it so I can't uh, uh, 
That's just me. <laughs> can't uh, can't help it. Uh, if I posted the reviews as I done them, eventually I'd have to review. review. It seems there would be new it's, videos it's, going up. Sometimes it happens. I, I posted seven lives without any review. I did seven lives. Uh, with a with a show in my own life, seven lives in a row without any review between it. <laughs> uh, so that that's why I thought this week I'm gonna post some more. <laughs> I'm gonna post five reviews so <laughs> they see I'm started again. Because <laughs> uh, and it's, it will always be like that. Um, when I'm excited about something and I record it, I want it online. And and when I'm and when there's there are I had a, a lot of days I just wasn't in the mood of doing anything and, and when I'm not in the mood I'm not recording so then there's no reviews <laughs> I'm, I, I, it has to stay a hobby for at the moment because I still got the other job it has to stay a hobby and it started to be a job and I don't want that anymore for the moment so also with chatting and, and sending mails and everything I answer the mails and I answer the chats when I'm one to answer them not when they send me at night I start answering them or send me in the, during the day and I don't I just answer when I'm one to <laughs> so uh, I'm taking it a little bit slower it's, it's better for me now because I'm getting exhausted again now and that's not good. <laughs> now, when I get up, I come here and sit here and vape on my pod to get my nicotine. And as I'm doing that, I'm checking my mails and answering them. No, I, I always answer my mails on, mails on my phone when I've got some time. And before, I, when a mail came in, it was instantly I started answering. And I don't do that anymore. I start thinking before I answer. <laughs> It's starting. Oh. I'm, I'm starting to think sometimes now. <laughs> it's been huh. no, still nothing new. No, okay. If anybody sends me an email or a message or anything at night time, I don't get it till I wake up because my phone's on silent. My the only thing I can hear is a alarm clock when we getting up. That's it. That's it. That's the same thing with me now. I said I put my phone on silent and I put it in the living room. I can't hear my phone anywhere, and I put it on silent too now at night. But before, yeah, I was always answering my phone. I was always up here till two, three o'clock in the morning. I don't do that anymore. <laughs> now, most of the time around ten o'clock, ten, uh, thir um, my ten thirty, I go down, and then, then it's finished with everything and I and I don't go to sleep too late anymore because it, it was getting too much <laughs> again <laughs> now I'm here till about 10 and then it's all switched off and I just sit in the bed watch tell yeah but when in in my time when the show ends it's already 10 now <laughs> yeah for you yeah I <laughs> know for me yeah I know so uh, we zijn met 11 hier en nog maar één like, alleen mensen druk op een duimpje. Uh. He says we are with 11 here and only one uh, thumbs up. That's not a lot, I know. <laughs> I think it was on yours. Yeah, that was on mine. Um, I've got three thumbs up and one thumb down. <laughs> a thumb down? A thumb down. <laughs> I don't know if it was there before we started like last week or not. On my on my phone I don't have one thumb up. <laughs> hmm. I don't have one thumb up on my phone. <laughs> People don't like me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not being checked how many you actually had in. Oh, oh ten. I missed one. Momai, Momai of T, hi, in my chat. I missed that one. Oh, I'll be up there. 
<laughs> uh, I don't know what I was. Uh. <coughs> I'm so excited. I want to start building something. <laughs> I want to build something. <laughs> can you not multitask? Multitask? Yeah. You can try. You should be able to be doing this show. We're looking at two charts. Keep up with me. <laughs> but, but I don't have any place to start building or I have to do it here. Just uh, do it where you are. Yeah. But I'm looking where my stuff is. Oh dear. <laughs> Wait. But what I'm gonna build? There it can put. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too excited for the FP. Okay, you you keep talking then. No. I start building. I've, to build. I've got a lot to build, so <laughs> you can start talking and <laughs> I start building. <laughs> got my build stand. Do would be put a coil. No, put cotton into the hive. Into the hive, uh. Yeah. But my mic's in the road, so I can't do it. I'm thinking which cause I'm going to use. Hmm, skills club. No, two and a half. It's a big tank. Okay, back. Let it me look at the holes. Hmm, no, it's okay with two and a half. Okay. Are you bought on the FP? The FP, yeah. And I'm gonna use some fuse claptons from Pro Bear. Uh, two, two times 26, one time 36 uh, wrapped around it, and two and a half on 0 0.13, they say. Let's see. <laughs> uh, see that, that's too low for me. <laughs> I'm always that low. Always that low. Oh. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Oh my god. Sorry. We'll just <laughs> sit and watch and see how long it takes you to build on it. Go a little bit lower. Uh, how much? How long it takes? Mm -hmm. I Let's reckon see. you'll still be there after half past. <laughs> Probably. Let's see. Yeah, that's okay. Take my coils. Well, now I've had the coils in Benin. Huh? <laughs> I've had the coils in Benin. Yeah, yeah. You want to know any coil? <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's not necessary for this one. Keep the coil in. Right, got any questions? Put it in chat. Make sure it's in English so I can read it. Since Dummy's too busy. <laughs> Make it a <laughs> competition between the two of your of you. They say, yeah, you don't have yeah. anything to build. <laughs> Can't as I don't have an FP. Uh, like this. But I'd win anyway, because that means swap ball me. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but I'm not building on a table or anything, that's not my thing. <laughs> La da da da. And chat's been quiet. Yeah. <laughs> all looking at oh, all looking at me. <laughs> oh, it's a mess in here. <laughs> I'm you so definitely need to get more organized. Yeah, I know. <laughs> the wife says it too. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Okay, that's that. 
Uh, What's your fuse clapton's coming out? Yeah, what? What's your fuse clapton's coming out? Well, I'm not here. It's it it would be zero point thirteen fuse clapton. And yet my fuse clapton's come out at zero point six eight. <laughs> zero point six eight. Yep. Okay. Two twenty eight gauge and one thirty two. For me, it's two twenty six and one thirty six. One twenty six mm. and one thirty six. So. Uh, that means it's vapor storm. Uh, for me, Procore. Handmade. Uh, okay, let's cut it. Okay, let's burn those coals. <laughs> what I see then? No. I want to see if you've got hot spots. <laughs> A man of your caliber shouldn't. Okay. Now battery low or something. Zero point eleven. <laughs> of course. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Looking nice. I seen that hot spot. <laughs> it would help if it was fine. It's not nah, it's still not right yet. No, no, it's not ready. <laughs> I know. <laughs> still busy. Don't want to. That's better. That's yeah. better. That's better. All right. Now that's ready. Now the cotton. The Valhalla cotton. Uh, yeah, Valhalla. I was thinking, what was um? Uh, normally for RTAs, I use a bus device, but. Then I have to search it, and I don't have to. <laughs> I don't have. To, I don't want to look for it in my back. So it's gonna be the Valhalla cotton. See, I just use a wee spare pad on everything. Nah, never actually. Okay, that's that. Cotton. All right. That looked too well, Dimi. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, the chat's definitely went quiet. Yeah. They're all looking. <laughs> <laughs> they all want to see me fail. <laughs> Dramatically. Yeah. Got some. Okay. So everybody that's watching, what are you using at this precise moment in time? Get something in chat. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Oh, if you want to be fast. <laughs> <laughs> That's better. The Valhalla cotton is a good cotton, but not always the easiest to use. <laughs> Needs a little bit less. Oh, chats. Wanneer in stock Valhalla cotton? <laughs> when wholesales got it. I don't know. <laughs> For the moment. I don't know. The VP drag with drop RDA. Is that the first drag, second drag? The VP drag, <laughs> yeah. The drop RDA. That's a good one. Well, it's a long time ago since I used it. Um, got a ballot box on the go? Hmm? A ballot box? 
Stone never had one in yet. No? No. Uh, yeah, got it. <laughs> Damn cotton. The fine design DS with recurve on top. Recurve on top. Uh. Okay, that's that. We're taking the Johns away that he's not put his on yet. Yeah, that is using about five different setups. <laughs> they cost. <laughs> uh. You still not done that yet. No. See, that's past half past. That's been ten minutes of being at that. Yeah. So, <laughs> on my review, on my reviews on the table, it goes faster. Now I'm just taking my time. I don't know what to say. So <laughs> I'm taking my time. Make sure you cut your cotton right. Yeah, that or further you get dry hits. And first time I'm building it, so that's some excuse. Yeah, that's an hour. What's Benny saying in your chat? <laughs> what an dump <laughs> That's what I'm always saying after the my my reviews. <laughs> it's my John. Chat. What are you using just now? Okay, and it's not easy to work like this. You not got a table in front of you? No, there's my laptop. Yeah. That's a problem. <coughs> That's why See I'm it? working like this. You need to invest in a wee table to sit in front of you. Um, I've got a big desk over there in the corner and that desk I'm going to when I've got my new computer that desk is going to move more this way and it's going to be re rearranged again but <laughs> first need the new computer first need to clean up here and then <laughs> start rearranging <laughs> so okay yeah. the, cot the cotton is almost in Let's see if it doesn't. Wild Wolf and the Aqua Master, John Jason. Yep, uh, I don't do stoppers, no, me neither. Okay. Juice. Juicing it up. A bit of time. <laughs> da, da, da. I'm taking my time. I noticed. <laughs> and now I fill the tank and it pours <laughs> out. <laughs> the show will be finished and you'll still be trying to get it to work. No, no. It's ready now. Where's the tank? <laughs> okay, take a mod to paste it. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Take batteries. Taking another mod again. Another mod. Yep, the Sigile. But what one? How it's called, I don't know. <laughs> And the Chinese on the back, I don't know what's saying, what it's saying. <laughs> okay, let's test out the FB. Nee, inderdaad, Patcher. Dan maar hopen dat hem niet leakt. Let's hope he doesn't leak. <laughs> huh? 
I pour in juice and everything comes out of it. Come on. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, airflow. How many watts? 80, 90. Let's start at. Start warm, what are you up? 75. Hmm, nice airflow. They put it a little bit more restricted. It's the first one. Yeah. On the a little bit more restricted, a little bit lower. Faping it on Eat My BB style. A little bit more. 60, 70, 73. Mm. With the airflow restricted, it has a lot of flavor. Nice. Nice. But with the airflow halfway, it has a whistle. <laughs> Open is too much for me. Halfway. No. <laughs> That's how I want it. Airflow. Uh, uh, the half on the smallest side and the half on the middle of the airflow. It's in in three steps. The airflow. Hmm. So it's halfway. Not halfway. A little bit over halfway. Not a, the not the closest to, to the to the smallest one, but. The halfway half open and the smallest one half open. <laughs> you can't, I don't know if you can see it on. You see, it's in three yeah. steps. It's three steps the airflow, and now half open in the middle and half open on the smallest, and that's how I like it. <laughs> that's nice. Yeah. That's how I have mine. Do you mean? Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. It's vapes nice. Uh, Hi Chris, by the way, and Chris is uh, testing his Zeus Dual. He needs to comb out his cotton a little bit more. Just translating for you. <laughs> <laughs> What's in my chat? Yeah. Hey, and it's not leaking, eh? <laughs> Yet. No, no, it's not leaking. And I'm See, when I, when I build a first tank, or on my first tank, I sit it over there in that wee tub for a day to see if it leaks. Nah, when I build it the first time I start vaping. I vape oh. it to get the pressure inside it, and then I sit it over there for a day. Yeah, I, I just set it on my desk for, <laughs> for the night and, <laughs> <laughs> and see what happens. Uh, can okay, you come back to it and you've got a big puddle of juice underneath it? Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> that's where I started to put it in a bowl. Yeah, that's a gamble. <laughs> that's the only gamble I do. I never gamble for money, so I gamble <laughs> with my tanks and my mats. <laughs> Shocking. Have you not even got a wee stand that you could put it on? Okay, something like that. Yeah, I know. I've got some, got some here. <laughs> but if you look at my closet and under all the things behind me, there's uh, there's a lot of <laughs> juice waste under my tank. So <laughs> that's why you should empty the juice out before you store it. I know, <laughs> and I still haven't cleaned anything. <laughs> <laughs> I know, <laughs> but uh, every time I think, yeah, now I'm going to do it, something comes <laughs> up. <laughs> so busy life, busy life. I always say. Yeah, another feeling. Uh huh. 
and then if you do some crazy things like fa live vape shows and everything too busy life bye Benny hi something only leak if you wick it wrong yep yep that's why you just check true. it to make sure I've wicked it right <laughs> <laughs> and it doesn't run dry so Well, yeah. I, tell, I test the dryness if I'm getting dry hits or not after it's had its day sitting to see if it's going to leak. But, oh, now it runs through. Okay. And can you open it with. <laughs> 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 We're gonna test something. <laughs> We're gonna well, test. Can you take the deck off with just on it? Yeah. You should be able to. Yeah. Cotton starts to run dry. So hmm. you've got too much cotton in there. Yeah, then. there's too much cotton. Okay. <laughs> wow, well, we're still running the show, so. <laughs> yeah. Uh, take some cotton out. Make it some. Uh, <laughs> uh, something in it. No. Okay. Now everything is on my pants. Alright. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I never built something like this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's where I've got a table in front of me. Yeah, but my table is full. <laughs> That's what's mine. On my on my own on my own live show I've got a table in front of me, but now with with, with the show for the for the the, the chat I've got uh, the 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 laptop in front of me so That's a problem. Mm. Uh, no cotton Okay. See, the show's got to be finished and you're still not going to hear that fixed. <laughs> yeah, okay, but it's the first time. Everything takes a little time to do it good. <laughs> uh, and it's for the first time I do it on my lap, so. <laughs> okay, oh, wicked I'm up again. Here. See, you're boring me. <laughs> <laughs> I think other cotton, yeah. I've normally for my RT8 I use other cotton, the bus device, and that really wicks fast. So the the, the Valhalla is better for a uh, RDA. The tank runs slightly empty, and if you damp it, I get dry hits. Hmm. On his RTA. Getting dry hits and leaking. Hmm. That's Seems not a good. bit strange. Yeah, that's a little strange. Not unless the cotton's not covering the hole proper when the juice is coming up and going straight out there. Yeah. Uh, it's not getting a chance to it. Gonna, st gonna put some other cotton in it tomorrow. Yeah, still runs a little bit dry, so the Valhalla isn't the best cotton for RTA, but nothing else in the neighborhood, so. See, that's why I use the pads, because they're just good on everything. Yeah, no, but yeah, but, but, ah, damn, I had a bus device here right beside me. <laughs> 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 Better use that one, but yeah, okay. Yeah. Maybe not be the best cotton, but it's an all in one cotton. Does a brand. <coughs> but the problem is, I run my RTAs on high wattage, so I need cotton that really soaks up fast. Because <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a chain vapor and I'm on high wattage, so 
my my cotton really has to keep up the pace from my vaping so not every cotton can do that <laughs> so on I'm going to challenge you next week's show you're going to have to use mods less than 40 watts wait <laughs> I've got a mod less than 40 watt the OBS is less than 40 watt 1.2 ohm coil in it <laughs> No, not in that way. No, as no. in something like that you're using just now, uh, but under 40 watts. But so you'll have to rick, coil and mix on that'll be suitable for 40 watts that's not mouse to run. I don't have coils that high. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have coils, only mine to long coils that high. I don't have normal coils going that high. Then I have to take a single coil RTA. Yeah. 0 0.2? 30 watts. <laughs> yeah, but I'm, uh, <laughs> one, I don't use stock calls, mm -hmm. and second, uh, not on that. Yeah, sometimes I, I te wait, I've got one to test. What wattage is it? Wait, wait, maybe I've got <laughs> one. The, la the lava, what wattage is it? <laughs> the lava from a uh, cool vapor. Uh, He's on the coil. Okay, 45 watts max. <laughs> All right. Between 32 and 45 watts on 0 0.5. I'm gonna use that one next week. <laughs> and what else are you using? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that low. I reckon you should use the FP. That low? Come on, this kind yes. of tank, nah. Yes. I don't have calls to go that low. <laughs> I, I have um, 0 0.2. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I've got 0 0.13 in it now, wicked. Uh, but your wattage to about 45, hold your airflow down by 45 watts. I'm on 45, close my airflow almost down. But that's, then I'm, <laughs> I, I keep on pulling that thing. <laughs> that's the problem. <coughs> Damn. Okay. <laughs> that felt good. <laughs> that's why all the junk is on the floor. My tank fell down, fell on all the junk, and nothing is broken. <laughs> <laughs> that's why. Okay. Uh, this got cotton from Cotton Jack. You know, I don't really like the cotton jack cotton. It's easy to use, but it doesn't wick fast enough. Also, good cotton for the RDA, but not RTA. Yeah, I got one that is. I think they're still talking about the ballot box. Uh, well, my life is still running. That's nice. <laughs> <laughs> no hesitations, nothing. My computer never popped up that uh, it's using too much CPU or something strange. <laughs> <laughs> Means it's still all fine. Huh? Strange that everything runs nice. Okay. Oh. Oh, I've got a lot of work to. <laughs> <laughs> Only ever use my Muji myself. See, square pads. Square pads? Hmm. Yeah, I, I change cotton a lot because I test a lot of cotton for the shop also. <laughs> if there's new cotton, I order new cotton and I test it for to see if it's good cotton. So sometimes I also use swag cotton. Swag isn't bad. So uh, I've got a whole 
bag full of cotton here and I, <laughs> I test them. So I, I change cotton a lot, but mainly I use my bus device if I test something for the first time. So better put that in the FP. <laughs> gonna re gonna re wiki tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, with the midges, where cotton's all you do is take a very thin layer from both top and bottom, yeah. cut it in half, and then cut your halves in half so you've got a quarter or four quarters and use one of them air coil. Yeah. Yeah. But and it's usually a bag of about a hundred or something you get at a time. And, and wet cotton is it? A puff cotton or? Uh, puff midge, anything like that. Yeah. I, I, I used to puff too but I, I didn't like the taste of puff. It takes a wee bit longer to get broken in, but it does everything, just for that. Uh, it's, just it's a long time ago I uh, I used that kind, I, mean, I used the pads, but that's a long time ago now. In the beginning I always used pads, it, it, it was easy, but... Take a top off, take the bottom off. You just try to get the top layer and no more. <laughs> that takes a lot of time. <laughs> <laughs> get your scissors and cut in the middle. And then cut in the middle again. Grab your other half, cut in the middle. And now I've got four wicks ready to go. Uh huh. And for uh, the what kind of coil? Two and a half millimeter, three millimeter? Uh, usually three millimeter. Uh. Just stick them back in my drawer. <laughs> ready to use? <laughs> yep. <laughs> what it is, make it round, pinch one end, and through the cotton, uh, the coil. Yeah, the bus device are like this, mm. and you pull off. But I feel I'm, I've got the feeling in the bus device how much I need, and it's just one pull, and it's always right. So <laughs> <laughs> that's the lucky thing that I'm, as I'm using it that much now. So. For me, that and, and it soaks up the fastest for the RTA, I think, in my opinion. And what's my opinion? <laughs> well, that's the thing, everybody's got their own opinions. <laughs> so, do me for the challenge you have to do for Mark, he has to use high wattage. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> I've got a seller, <laughs> and you can use 100 watts. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah. I've got that. Uh, uh huh. Which has got all different size of coils in it. Yeah, I got some. Mm. I also got a coil box. I use. I've got this one for it from Coilology, but they're all too low. Oh, shh. And I've got that <laughs> one as well, which I won't use because it's cancelled. No, I don't. No, I never use cancel. Um, and I've got some A1 clap dins as well, 0 0.4 ohms. Joe, that'll put down to 0 0.2. Yes, I could use them. <laughs> <laughs> You have to go lower, zero point, max zero point fifteen, <laughs> and then go up to one hundred and five watts. That's my wattage. I've got some juggernauts, which are point five ohms. But jugger juggernauts are point two five joule. Yeah, juggernauts aren't good cause. <laughs> I don't like juggernauts. <laughs> Yeah, they are. <laughs> uh, they they heat up they heat up too slowly. 
Uh, what else have I got? That's not good, that's only a single. Um, I don't know what kind that is. But I've only got one anyway, so I can't use it. <laughs> See, I don't have much in the way coils. I've got some micro coils, point one ohm. <laughs> yeah, that's not for high vaping. <laughs> I know. I've got more micro coils, which are point one ohm. You see a trend here. Oh, my phone is down. <laughs> my battery from my, from my phone is down. Is <laughs> okay. <laughs> and I've got more. Um, micro coils at 0.6 ohms, but the roughest thin, they must be about a 2 mile diameter, inner diameter. That's small. <laughs> and then I've got loads of bags of coils as well, which is 1.4 ohm, 1 ohm. Oh, big ohm. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got some wire as well that I could probably use. Make a normal micro coil with. Uh, I've got some wires too. Yeah. Coilology wire. Maybe I can make a high wire. Uh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe some wire. Maybe I make my own. <laughs> I've got a lot of wire here. But I don't have a lot of prefab coils anymore. One box here and then here yeah, the pro coils from the pro bear coils, but they're all too low. So and <laughs> I'm gonna wait. Huh? I'm gonna see if something high enough is in this box. See, zero point fifteen. Nah, all too low. And uh, if I want, I can just read a box from an RDA or an RT and take the coils out of the box. <laughs> yeah, that that the coils I'm that come with RDAs and RTAs, I don't use. Me neither. Most of the time I don't use them either, so I've got a lot of calls the, of those in. <laughs> yeah, so when I do a giveaway of an RDA or an RTA, what's in the box, that's what they get. Yeah, but I only do giveaways with things I've got, uh, <laughs> got double, so... <laughs> I only See, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> and I've got two giveaways running now, so... <laughs> I, I maybe need to do a giveaway oh. on my Facebook group. No, not done one yet. Um. And I've got <coughs> woods to get rid of. Oh my, I'm dying. <sighs> I'll just grab one of the empty boxes that's in that corner, fill it up and say, right, this is what's for giveaway. <laughs> um, <laughs> no. Now I've got the bulk running and I've got uh, yeah, the, the relics running. And I just gave away coils on my on my live chat, and no, man, don't give away that bulk. I want it. <laughs> hey, it's already in giveaway. Shocking. <laughs> and I've got one spare. I've got two spares, <laughs> a black one and a gold one. I keep it for myself. <laughs> give me the black one. No gold, because I will be on camera. I'm using the gold. <laughs> That's shocking. Yeah. Look, I'm using the gold. <laughs> you had another spare one sitting. Yeah, black one. <laughs> well, that's not good for camera work. Though. Yeah, and the stainless I used in the give in my uh, review, and I'm giving it away. <laughs> Build it. No, I'll give it to me. Give him the black one. <laughs> it's it's already built, it and I'm giving the stainless. I want to keep the black one for all my black moths. <laughs> I like the book. <laughs> I'm gonna use it. <laughs> no. So you'll but just have to speak to to Jessica, Jennifer, Jessica, Jessica, or Emma, or yeah. Uh, get them the same. <laughs> <laughs> I, I gave them the, your card, but uh, there's not. It's, they, they want to send out the armadillo to Jay Hayes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So show me that. Huh? What's wrong with that? The armadillo? Oh, yeah. The Jay Hayes. The, the drama mine. <laughs> they, go, they want to send him the armadillo. Jay's actually not a bad guy when you get to get him. Mm, I, I don't know him yet, so. But 
I'm scared. <laughs> what he's gonna do with the armadillo? <laughs> that's the yeah, problem. They always just smash things up and everything. But yep, that's why <laughs> I'm scared that I'm gonna send him. <laughs> so. It's only for fun. <laughs> I know, but <laughs> it can it can hit me in the back. <laughs> <laughs> so. Mm. Oh, it's ten anyway, o'clock. That's the time. <laughs> so we, we made it. <laughs> we actually done a show without any tickets. No. And we got the store shut. The show started on time. Almost, yes. But, no, we did, because we, both of us was recording oh. our... Our b um, beginning screen, okay. Yes. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> At time. <laughs> And we may didn't start talking to everybody at all after the time, but we'd still got the show going at the right time. Okay. Which is a plus for us. <laughs> <laughs> and we're getting better in it. No, we're, we're getting better in it. <laughs> yeah. So we got a guest on again and everyone goes to it. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Yeah. We'll see for next week. <laughs> yes. Hi Next Tom, Radio day. Exit, good evening, <laughs> good evening, and we're just going to stop, you're just too late Tom. <laughs> <laughs> right, so thanks everybody that's come and watched the show, and posted on both charts. We will be back next week, and I think we've got a guest for next week. We do our best. <laughs> <laughs> um, so next week there should be a guest and if not then it'll just be me and Dima again <laughs> always a surprise with the crazy vape show <laughs> yes. good night um, everybody from my side <laughs> <laughs> so thanks for coming along and enjoying your wee bit of banter that's going on between us and I'll use posting questions which is always nice and if you did like the show give us a thumbs up and if you didn't, give us a thumbs down. Any will do. Please subscribe to both <laughs> of us. The links are in both charts. Let me just copy mine and put an image. <laughs> Mark's going to do that. <laughs> yeah, John, we were a few minutes late. Yeah, I know, but let Mark think <laughs> we were on time. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so both links for our YouTube channels are in both charts. Click them, subscribe to us. And um, if you want, you can subscribe to me on VapeTube. Because I'm on that. Are you on that yet, Demi? VapeTube? I, I'm on VapeTube. I'm so on VapeTube. You can yes. subscribe to both of us on VapeTube um, and yeah. any other social media that we've got. Obviously, yeah. we're not going to post links to every single bit of social media both of us has because it'll take that long. <laughs> right. <laughs> Thanks again for coming along. If it wasn't for you coming and watching us, there wouldn't be a show. That's right. I'm ready to go. Wait. So, thanks again. <laughs> Stay <We're> safe <laughs> and bye just now. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>